you've ever wished you could just be a fly on the wall <laughs> at a family run farm, then today's for you. You have been asking to see more of the farm and I just haven't shown a ton of it so far on my channel but it's definitely a very big part of our lives and today I thought would be the perfect day to just take you along because it's actually heyday at the farm. No pun intended, although for the kids it's also just best day ever. They are baling hay outside and unloading it in the barn, so I'll show you some of that. Obviously I'm working on green beans. I have a great big pile of green beans that I picked in the garden. And normally I freeze my green beans, but this year I'm gonna to try to can them. I kind of ruined frozen green beans for us the first year that we were married because I didn't blanch them and learned my lesson the hard way. But I have frozen them since, but I thought it would be fun to try the canning method. So that's what we're gonna do inside today. And then I'll also, when it's milking time and stuff, I'll take you out there and show you around some. The lighting in the barn is pretty terrible, but <laughs> maybe I can show you a bit of that and then the calves and how they're fed and all that stuff. You would like me to include more like on the farm type content on my channel, then leave me the little farmer emoji so that I know to do more of this. I feel like that We've done so little like fixing up in those areas and a lot of it is pretty run down like the calf hutch for example Josh has been talking about so long that just really needs to be done but you just can't do everything all at once so it's not the prettiest out there but I'm just so grateful for this lifestyle that we get to raise our kids here. It's a lot of hard work, but so rewarding. Okay, I'm gonna keep tackling this. So see you in about two hours when this is done. <laughs> a super rough chop of these and make them about I don't know two inches long and then I'm gonna put them in jars is barn time so Kyra is in charge of all these little calves um, you can... <laughs> are you helping her fill the buckets yeah nice I like to do the oh. oh there's the bucket yeah. and there's the and there's the What do you do? First you give them all fresh water? No, I, I first I give them milk. And milk? I, and then I feed those to feed what I don't have to first, but then I feed my water stuff. Curious little thing.
So Kyra, what time do you come out here in the morning? Seven o'clock. Seven o'clock in the morning. She's out here feeding the calves and then again late afternoon, right? Hudson, what do you have in your wagon? Hey. Hey. Is that chopped today? Yep. Very fresh from the field. Wow, that's pretty fun. They get to come out here and eat and drink water and get some fresh air. And then this evening they'll walk down into the meadow and graze overnight. veggies in the garden and all kinds of stuff but we're actually going out to eat tonight which is so exciting we try to go out one night a week and that night is tonight so I'm super excited I love cooking and working in the kitchen but I always look forward to this night out so it's always so fun to just have a day off and anyway tonight we're planning to go to one of our favorite little it's actually like a coffee shop, but they have nice outdoor seating with string lights and stuff. So it's a really fun place to go and also pretty relaxed though going with kids and stuff. So that's what's on the menu tonight. My outfit for the evening is super old. This one was from the Main Street Exchange. I can link it, but honestly it's like probably at least four years old. Thanks for 
for joining us on the farm today. If you like this video, don't forget to leave the little farmer emoji in the comments below. Thank you for being here and I hope you have a wonderful week. Bye friends. Golden, golden thing.